Lots of people say things like, it was just a joke, I didn't mean it, it you know, you're too uptight, or I'm just a kind of friendly, outgoing guy. Um, you know, I, I'm like this with everybody. Well, the interesting thing there would be to see if you would do that thing, whatever that thing is, whether it's, uh, you know, hugging somebody, put your arm around somebody, or stand very close, or ask about certain aspects of their life, is if you do it with everybody, then do it with a male boss. And if you wouldn't do it with a male superior, whether it's in the military or in your football team or in your bank or wherever you are, if you wouldn't, then you are not being honest and you're doing it because you know fundamentally you have some kind of entitlement to do it which you are exploiting. You're always so tense. Honestly, look at you. Confronting somebody about their behaviour doesn't have to be done in an aggressive or antagonistic way. People can learn how to positively and constructively challenge unacceptable behaviour in a way that encourages people to think about um, the impact of their behaviour on others and encourages them to change their underlying attitudes as well as the behaviours that are unacceptable in the workplace. Michael, have you got a minute? Sure. What's up? Look, I know you're just trying to be nice, but I don't like it when you come up and do all that massaging and back rub stuff. I'd really like it if you didn't do it anymore. Well, excuse me, Julia. That's just how I am, you know? I'm a hands-on kind of person. I give them to everyone. I don't think I've seen you give Graham or Lewis a back rub. So, I'll tell you what. If you think I look stressed, I'd love a cup of tea, yeah? Dash of milk, two sugars. All right. I think you've made your point, yeah? Thanks. <laughs>